National Weather Service survey crews out of Tulsa have continued to sift through the debris, analyzing not just the debris on the ground, but of course, radar data as well. They're combing through all of the information to give a good, solid damage rating. Here's what we know so far. Of course, this information is subject to change uh, as they continue to do their analysis. EF3 tornado just to the west of Decatur. This was first reported as a monster 3,000 yard wide tornado. However, the latest information out of the Weather Service is it was actually 3,200 yards, so even larger. Second tornado that moved just to the south of Decatur, crossing 59 before dissipating uh, there at 102. That was an EF2 tornado. Got a couple of uh, spin ups here near Centerton, one of which moved through what's uh, referred to as Papa Hollow, and then you got uh, another one that moved through parts of Centerton. That was an EF1. You drill down into the specifics, and this is what we've got. The Decatur tornado number one, the strongest of all, EF3. Peak winds 145 to 155 miles per hour. Now, uh, survey crews say it was actually 3,200 yards wide. That's 32 football fields put back to back, side by side. That's longer than the Golden Gate Bridge. Very large tornado. Likely, as of right now, that will be the new widest tornado in Arkansas history. It was on the ground for 7.9 miles. That second tornado that went just to the south of town, winds were anywhere between 120 to 130 miles per hour, classifying it as an EF2 with a 650 yards and on the ground nearly five and a half miles. We get closer to that Centerton tornado number one. It was an EF1 winds uh, at its peak 90 to 100 miles per hour. It's with 600 yards and it was on the ground a little bit shorter, 2.3 miles. Certainly did some destruction while it was on the ground. And then the Papa Hollow tornado also rated an EF2 winds here 115 to 125 miles per hour. It was rather wide as well, 1500 yards wide on the ground for 2.4 miles. Survey crews acknowledge there are other areas of likely tornado debris uh, in the midst of a lot of widespread uh, straight line wind damage. It's just going to take them some more time to sift through the debris, do a good thorough analysis. Uh, they continue to send updates to us. We'll pass those along to you.